Today, I hired a Rubik's Cube teacher from Fiverr to show us how to solve a Rubik's Cube. Obviously, we are somewhat fast. We are going to pretend to be a total beginner in front of the teacher and do some of the craziest stuff. Can I just turn this? <laughs> and at the end of the lesson, we will race our teacher and review who I am. Also, this is my friend Kobe, who is also going to be helping with this prank. Uh, hi, I can hear you now. Okay, perfect. Hi, what's your name? Uh, my name is Leo. Leo, nice to meet you. It's also, I have my friend here. My name is Kobe. So we both want to learn today. We're both fast learners. Do you think we can learn how to solve a Ruby's Keep in one lesson? I think so, yeah. Okay, great. Let's let's start learning. But what he doesn't know is that as the lesson goes on, we are going to get progressively more annoying. So what we're going to be doing is we're first going to be making a cross, which is the first step of how to solve it. You'll move the top away and then bring it up. Perfect. Just bring it up. Not the sun. No, no, wait. You can go back and there should be like a white edge. It's a spot that isn't white. Oh, we got it. We got three pieces. Oh, oh. You have to do it. We did it. Right? But we need to make sure that the these pieces are matching. So there's a green and a red. So if you bring up the white piece back next to the... There we go. Per like this. Perfect. Thank you. My friend try. He has the stickerless cube. So does it matter what color we start with? Because I, I think I already have a lot of greens here. So could I just do that? We can we can do it from green. It's just you really? get advanced with cubing. You can use something called being color neutral, where you can start from any side. But typically you learn white, but we can do it with green if you like. We can do white, but actually green. I like green better. Uh, yeah. Look at he made it more green. But can I just turn this? See, like it was like this, but wouldn't you go like this to make it fully green? You can do that. Is that illegal? It, it's illegal if you do it in competition. Also, it can make it unsolvable. So we'll, we'll do the green side. Uh, hold the green. And yes. what you're going to do, find the other green. <laughs> this one. Uh, no, not that one. This one? That one. This yeah. one? Yeah, perfect. Side with the flipped edge uh, two times. One, two. Yes. Perfect. And then... Put the green side on the bottom, don't, yeah, just like that. And then turn it away, turn the... Turn the piece on. And then okay. bring the right side back up. This side up. Oh my goodness. And now what you're going to do is take the right side. This side, this side. Rotate, yeah. No, 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 go back. Uh, turn the whole cube and then turn the right side up. Yeah, uh, two more times. One. Oh. Perfect. And now if you look at the green sides, you've got a green cross. Hopefully at this rate, we will beat the teacher because at the end, we are going to race. I'm gonna introduce you to an algorithm. It's very easy and very easy to remember. It's- What is it called? <laughs> it's called the sexy moves. We're gonna put it in by doing this right up. And the teacher taught us the four move sexy algorithm, but we got a little off topic. Does your parents allow this? My parents have allowed this, yes. The sexy move? Yeah, they do allow. I taught my dad the sexy move. Oh, wow. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> you taught your dad the sexy move? I did. How many hours does he practice it? Oh. oh. So many. Is that good? You done it. That's the first layer. That's the first layer. So are we almost done? Do we have six more sides to do? Or seven. Um, let's switch. I just have another question for you. How old were you when you solved it for the first time? Well, I solved it for the first time, I think, when I was 10. Yeah, because I saw a Chinese kid, they start when like three year old or something. Like I heard like- They they recently broke the, the record average, which was very exciting. Do you watch a lot of Ruby's cubing, YouTubing? Yeah, I do. Who Is you that watch? how you learned? How did you learn? Yeah, because I tried to learn on YouTubing and it was so hard to learn. That's why we booked this lesson. Uh, I watch a couple different people. Who do you watch? Like, I need to write these names down. So I watch a channel called J Perm, who that's who I actually learned solve it initially from. Watch some other channels, like I watch Cubehead and Soup Timmy and uh, some other accounts. So like the Cube. So it was J, how do you spell J Perm? So it's just J and then P E R M. Okay. Is that his actual name, J Perm? His actual name is Dylan. Oh, Dylan. Yay! That's how I feel oh. like this. <laughs> ah, he slapped me! Someone just
And then you said cube head. Cube Cubic head. And then there's soup to me. Soup to me. It, that sounds Fancy like a name. cooking channel. <laughs> yeah. I got a cube from J Perm, like a J Perm cube. D does soup to me have a cube? I'm not sure actually. I can look that up for you. He should honestly, if he's good. What, what does Soup Timmy make? Does he just make soup Rubik's Cube videos? From Soup Timmy, I quite like, it's not probably one of his most hard videos to make, but he made a video where he took a mirror cube and showed how to put it into a tripod, and I use it at every competition. That's awesome. Whatever a mirror cube is, but that's okay. Here, let's get back to this lesson. Luckily, I don't think he recognized us, so we're gonna finish solving the first layer. Yeah, there you go. One, I love sexy. Two, I love sexy. Three, I love sexy. Yay! First layer's done. There you go. Actually, I have a confession. I already know how to solve a Ruby's cube because you see this cube here? Yeah. Um, can, <laughs> I, can I ask a question? And I'd, li I'd like you to be quite honest with me. Yeah, I won't be honest, but go ahead. You might have maybe cued like the that? stickers or something. I, I solved it. See, it's solved. It's <laughs> obvious that it's solved. The, 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 stickers, the stickers look quite... Um... What's wrong? If you steal my cube, see how the yellow is like here? Yeah, yeah, yellow is here. And the white is opposite? Yeah. Um, yeah, we the, can make white the, opposite. See? No, white, no, the, opposite. The yellow can't really be touching the white, so you're never going to have a yellow so white. So can't white, white and yellow can't be friends? No, they can't be friends. No! <laughs> 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 okay, anyways. So now you're gonna do left up. Left up. Turn the top counterclockwise. Perfect. And then left back down, and that's it. I think you're breaking yeah. up. <laughs> you're breaking up with me? <laughs> <laughs> like your, screen, your screen's frozen, because I, like, so I can't really see like what your cube looks like. Yeah, I like Elsa too. I like Elsa. Elsa's great. So this, this next move is called Elsa, I assume? Uh, you can call it Elsa if you like. All right, let's call this Elsa. All right, so what do we do? I'm going to memorize Elsa. So we have sexy move and Elsa. I think we're making a sentence here. You're going to start is you're going to start by pushing the green and orange piece away to the left. Pushing. Yeah, okay. perfect. And then you're going to do that left sexy. So left up. Rotate the cube around you, you'll be able to see. Um, it's going to just do one right to gag, or one sexy. one sexy, okay. Yeah. And then we do Elsa. Rotate the whole cube one to the right. Okay. You just did it and then went back. Yes. Then do left up. Left up. Is this Elsa? Yeah. Turn the top. Okay, turn Elsa. The turn the top to the left. And then left back down, and that's the second layer done. Okay. Uh, so now what we're gonna do is now that we have that piece on the top, is you're gonna push it away. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> Continue. And then just Elsa. Elsa. And that's second layer. Let's go. One more. I don't, oh wait, we, yeah, you're right. Second, first layer, second layer, third layer. And finally, we are moving on to solving the last layer. What we're gonna do is we're gonna hold the yellow on the bottom. The all yellow on bottom. What you wanna do is you wanna hold the yellow center on the bottom. Okay. And then you're gonna do the righty outs. Do the right, uh, do the sexy moves. Yes. Until it goes in. Yeah, perfect. Oh, we got the yellow. Um, it's gone. Um, oh, um, my white destroyed. No! <laughs> I put a few off the stickers, man. I can't do this. I keep failing too much. <laughs> <laughs> I give up, man. I'm sorry. I can't do this. I just can't do this. I don't. I don't know what to do anymore, man. Here, I'll put them back. I'll put them back. I'll put them back. I'll put them back. I think I can figure this out. Here, go back to my friend. Okay. So you last time you said I that he was a better student. So I've been paying more attention and get ready for this. Remember how we did the orange? Now look at this too. I did red also. What two sides? Can I can I see the whole cube? Isn't that? Oh wait. Uh. Okay. 
Um, I was just messing around. I was trying to do the red side and the orange. And then how do I do this though? Yeah, he can't twist the corner or peel off the stickers. Is this messed up? So what, what we're gonna do? This is the impossible case he was talking about. So this isn't actually an impossible case. Uh, so it looks like this. With the ring finger. Oh! And then turn the top that way, counterclockwise. Then middle back down. Oh no, I think I messed it up. Um, I think I messed it up. Turn. Peel off the stickers again. There's no stickers. Oh man, this is why I should have bought more sticker cubes. I told you to buy a sticker cube. My mom got me this one. Oh, that's okay. Is this like a good one? Yeah, is that a good cube? Do you think it sucks? Uh, do you know what cube it is? I don't know. I think it's a Chinese brand. Do you know what brand? I don't know, maybe, maybe Yamaha? I'm pretty sure they do pianos. Oh. I might be confusing it for MSI. Can I try to go back? Like, I messed this up. I don't know what to do. Maybe this? Maybe turn the, turn the top? Maybe? Maybe? Call me, maybe. Oh, hey, I just made Now you've got the same case before we got it back. What you're going to do is you're going to turn the middle twice. <sighs> there. And then you're going to turn the top counterclockwise. Oh, no, only once, only once. Oh. And then middle down. And then turn the top twice. Move the middle up. And then turn the top. Uh, change this once. There you go. <gasps> and then turn the top. Wait, can I do the last moves? You can decide you did the last moves. Oh, <gasps> <gasps> That's so cute. Thank you so much. I will practice and I'll time myself and you can help Tommy, okay? He peeled off the stickers on this. No, that was you. Oh man, he got me. I got back to the step without peeling the stickers off. Are you proud of me? I'm very proud. Thank you. What we're gonna do is start by turning the top clockwise once. Uh, no, and then rotate the whole cube to the right. Okay, one, two. You mean sexy move, right? Turn the whole cube to the right. Yep. And three ounces. Elsa's, we're coining that term Elsa. We're gonna make it the new name. So now you've got something we call H perm. H perm. There's every letter. Wow, so there's Z perm, J perm, D perm, F perm, D J I P perm, perming D perm, B T S perm. Okay, let's do H perm, ready? Middle twice. Middle twice. After this we can race, right? And turn the top one. Yeah. Uh, if you would like. We're gonna go from start to end. And then <gasps> We did it! We solved it! We solved a Rubik's Cube! Yes. Oh, that's, really good. that's amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you for helping us, like... Now, it was time for me to race the teacher. You said 15 seconds, though. I don't know if we could do that yet. But you should try to go as fast as you can, okay? Good luck. I don't know how you're gonna do. Okay, ready? Three, okay. two, one, go. We beat you in one lesson. High five. We beat the teacher. Can I make a guess that this isn't your first time solving a Rubik's Cube? No, it's my first time. Just <laughs> Is it? Are you just a really fast learner? Yeah, we're really, we looked up YouTube how to beat Rubik's Cube teacher. Yeah. Yeah, thanks to like the, the Soup Timmy Cube coming out soon, we, we beat you. I, I'm taking the guess that you are Soup Timmy. Yeah, you are. Yeah. <laughs> I've seen yeah. some of you. Yeah. Some of your Fiverr videos before. You seen my Fiverr videos? Some of your Fiverr videos, yeah. <laughs> Wait, did you not recognize it was me or you were like suspicious? I, I sort of knew from like the exact beginning, but like good content, isn't it? What? Good content. What? <laughs> you knew from the beginning? Yeah. Even the mask didn't help? Not really, you got quite a distinguishable voice also. What? <laughs> Oh. Yeah, when I when you asked me about YouTubers, I put left you to last. Ah, wow. That was so good. <laughs> you played along so well. You played you actually played along, like you knew we weren't beginners. 90% sure and then you started the recording and I was like, yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. I'll see if I can get you a soup Timmy cube, some nice things from Speed Cube Shop. Thank you so much for this lesson. Thank you so much. Been a pleasure. See Bye. You. Bye. <laughs> 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 <laughs>
Dude, you have to post that. That was so good.